Hey everyone, welcome back to 365 Ninja. I'm going to show you how to add a watermark to your PowerPoint slides, which is really useful in the case of a draft or a confidential document that you don't want to get outside of your organization. It just gives an extra way to warn anyone who might be viewing or working with the PowerPoint of its status. So unlike in Word, where you have an actual button that puts a watermark on every page right in the ribbon, you have to do a little bit of a workaround in PowerPoint. What we're going to do is actually add text to our master slides. So to get to your slide master, go to the View tab, click Slide Master. Now I'm going to scroll up and select the topmost slide. Now I'll go to my Insert tab select text box and add a text box just in the middle of my slide. And then you can add the text that you want your watermark to be. So I'm just going to put draft. Now I'm going to resize my text and actually move the text box around a little bit so it looks like a watermark that you might traditionally see in a Word doc. might take a couple of tries to get right like you saw that I had there. So now we'll go to text options in the format shape bar. And if you don't see this, you can go to the format tab and click this little pop out window here. I'm going to select this first option, text fill and outline, and then transparency is what we'll use to make it look like a draft watermark that kind of fades into the background. So I'm going to increase the transparency, take a look at it, increase it a little bit more till it looks like how I like. All right, now that looks like a watermark to me. So I'm going to close the master view. And now I can see it on the background of all my slides. And you'll notice in slides like this one where I actually have a pretty large amount of images and text on my slide, you can't see the watermark anymore. But on slides where there's not as much text, you can. So Keep that in mind, that's a limitation of this workaround. Since we're not actually adding something to the top of the slide, we're actually adding something to the background. So one fairly simple option for adding a watermark of sorts to your slide decks. Hope that tip helped. For more tips and tricks like this one in Office 365, please check back with 365ninja.com. Thanks.